Over 1.2 million people living with cancer in Bangladesh and continuously growing sadly. Estimated 200,000 new cancer patients each year with limited specialist cancer care, facilities and inadequate medical treatment. 98% of cancer patients in Bangladesh are not receiving the treatment they need, namely the poor underprivileged residing around remote villages. Biani Bazaar Cancer and General Hospital is a charity based in the UK that aims to create awareness and provide medical treatment for the disadvantaged cancer patients in Bangladesh. Let's look at their journey. 2009, British Bangladeshi community decide to open a cancer hospital in Biani Bazaar in Bangladesh. Until 2015, phase one completed and officially opened to public on 20th of February to provide detection and awareness. Dedicated community health workers begin to visit remote villages to raise cancer awareness and inform hospital services. Here is a quick glance of the Biani Bazaar and Cancer Hospitals since 2015. We have many stories. Here is a story about Shoba. This is Shoba, full of happiness and laughter. Until few weeks ago, pain and suffering of gallbladder stones emerged her body. Fortunately, Biani Bazaar Cancer and General Hospital gave hope to Shoba and her mother. The hospital not only operated and treated Shoba, but money from the poor fund was also handed for living expenses. You raise me up. Biani Bazaar Cancer and General Hospital partnered with two mainstream schools in London Borough of Newham. The schools are not just raising funds, but the students are also performing at the Biani Bazaar Cancer charity events, globally in Bangladesh, here as well as in the UK. Biani Baza Cancer and General Hospital have dedicated trustees, over 50, donating of £25,000 each and over 600 life members' donations of £1,000 each, all working together voluntarily. Biani Baza Cancer and General Hospital aims to combat financial hardships, late diagnosis, poor radiotherapy facilities, unavailability of a complete cancer specialised hospital, poor funding from the government for cancer, lack of NGOs to tackle the problem, lack of cancer registries and low levels of awareness. To fully equip the hospital with different types of tests and treatment equipment, plans to complete the building is estimated to cost around £10 million. The current treatment facilities will also have diabetics, physiotherapy and radiotherapy, providing specialist treatment. Join us today, become a valuable volunteer, a life member, a trustee and be the change you want to see in the world. Get involved. I'm not